I still didn't know how to meet Maurizio Catalan, but my inspiration was to come from the one Catalan in a British collection. I was hungry, but all he offered me was black coffee. Right. There's no milk in the fridge because the fridge is full. Right. Oh my God. Oh God. Oh dear. That is Betsy. Whose granny is that? That's my granny. I went to Maurizio and I said to Maurizio, you know what? I want a really, really cool piece by you because I think you're fantastic. So he says, you know that fridge in the corner of your kitchen? No. We are going to stuff your granny and we're going to put her in the fridge so she stays there forever. <laughs> when I said we were doing a sculpture of it, I think she had visions of Churchillian bronze sculptures in Hyde Park. Right. Betsy was the most extreme Catalan I had seen yet. I couldn't tell if this was a work of art or just a joke at a rich collector's expense. I felt Catalan was making fun of me too. What's Maurizio like? Maurizio is a profound joker. He's one step ahead of you. He's always trying to take the piss out of you. Uh, and he loves it when you give as good as you take. Really? Yeah, uh, he loves it. Really? I don't think he respects people who don't give as good as they take. In my effort to find out whether the artist was having a laugh, I invited Catalan's double for an interview in London. In his daily life, the double is an Italian curator, but today he is Maurizio Catalan. He thinks he's here to do an interview with me, but I'm just posing as the doorman. Do I open it? Oh my God. Why did you put me in this fridge? I don't know, do you like it in there? Do you put other people in fridges? Uh, no, actually, you're the first one. Oh, I'm so thrilled. I'm <laughs> you should be so delighted. pleased. I'm the first, that's exciting. The other thing... Mr. Catherine. <laughs> well, I think you should sit. Can we keep the... Free in, oh. worry, I'm enjoying this conversation. Are you? I'm kind yes. of scared. How do I function as a work of art? Oh, you don't. Then I am ambiguous? Uh, no, you, you're just there. Why is it supposed to be funny? Art is usually not thought of as funny, so uh, whenever I do something that people find it funny, they actually find it difficult to believe it's art. Are you, are you trying to use me as a, to interrogate perhaps time, memory and intergenerational relations? I guess you can say that, but really for me it's always actually an exercise in emptiness. I, I really don't have anything to say. I had briefed the sculpture to investigate her own paradoxes, but she was not getting very far. While Catalan didn't give interviews, his double didn't answer questions. Are you afraid of people finding out that you are an imposter? I've always been very sincere about myself lying, so, you know, nobody can frame me because I never pretended I was telling the truth. 